Today, we're joined by Meg, who is the Assistant Manager of uh, Woolies at Kringle Hub and is a local who's uh, lived in Mount Eliza and is now in Somerville, so knows a lot about what our local community has been going through uh, during the coronavirus crisis. And no worries, thank you for having us. Ah, anytime. Nice so, first and most important question, how are you doing? You know, how are you getting We're good. Yeah. It was it was fun as much as it was chaos. Um, it's it's nice to walk in every morning and and see what you've achieved the day before. And uh, it was interesting at the start because we didn't know what was happening, and you know everyone started buying every single tin of soup on the shelf. But and toilet yeah. paper, don't forget the toilet and paper. And toilet paper, absolutely. <laughs> I was that person that was handing out toilet paper one by one. But um, there there's absolutely some funny stories. Um, I normally got on the PA and and page that I have toilet paper, the truck's in, if you can all line up. And <laughs> some days we'd have a line of two, 300 people. And I was like, oh my God, surely not, surely not. But um, yeah. It must have been full on. Um, so I don't know if it's, it's, I don't know if it's a retail thing, um, but you get this sort of sense of adrenaline uh, when you see people everywhere and it's, it's absolutely pumping. And we have 160 team members working here and, we had checkout chicks doing night fill because we didn't have enough humans to get the load away. Like, and everyone was learning new stuff so they could support. And so all those people that we've hired are backfilling, which is great because the jobs that they can't go to, we're obviously now financially supporting them with work here, which is, which is also a positive. And do you know whether they're people who have lost their jobs because of um, the shutdowns or whether they were people that were just looking for jobs before anyway? Um, so... I actually put a Facebook post on the Langwar and Locals uh, thing in, uh, on Facebook and said, you know, we're hiring to support people who've lost their jobs through coronavirus. Within the first 48 hours, I had over 400 resumes on my desk, which I think really hit home for us. Yeah. Um, it, was, it was pretty uh, pretty sad. And it was, you know, I had scientists and um, regional managers of, you know, massively overqualified to put stock on a shelf that just needed to support their families. So that was uh, a massive thing for myself and the team going through those resumes. And um, we had one business that had closed down, which was a travel business. And we had about seven people just from that one business supply. And, you know, as much as you can't give everybody a job, we tried to prioritise absolutely the people that did not have work. Wow. That's Amazing, and but to have that many people from Lang Warren, yeah, well, yeah, it was shows, doesn't it? The impact on our community. So, I wanted to ask you just before we finish up. Um, so I've obviously had lots of people, and particularly elderly people, contacting me over the last six weeks about being able to get uh, groceries in all of the circumstances, and I think a lot of people have. Um, got used to the pattern now, but um, all of the supermarket chains have different ways of doing online shopping and priority shopping. Woolworths has a priority shopping um, facility available online, don't you? Yep, absolutely we do. Um, so you just go to the Woolworths website and, and fill in the priority shopping uh, form. Um, if you have trouble doing it, come in and see us in store. Paul or our service manager will absolutely help you out, um, or any of us will really. Um, to get you that service, everyone has to eat, and a lot of people in our community don't have that uh, younger generation to help them with computers all the time as well. So that's a massive, massive thing that we're trying to help. And my mother tried to buy ten apples, and she bought ten bags of apples. Uh, the other nice. Day. Um, <laughs> everyone has a story. <laughs> learning how to make apple pie as we speak. Um, yeah, good, good choice. So Meg, thank you so much. Um, it's really great to get an insight into what's happening. Um, can you so, please thank yourself for everything that they've Of doing? course I can. We thank them every day. I couldn't tell you how many lunches we've cooked, KFC we've ordered, um, made sure they're all fed, happy and healthy because uh, food means everybody over, absolutely. Well, it's lovely to chat to you and when I'm allowed to go shopping again, um, I will pop in and say hello. Absolutely. Join, join us. Uh, we are absolutely an awesome supermarket with an awesome team, uh, which is about to get awesomer. So, yeah, it's going to be great.